Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you have ever wondered if your Windows version that you are running has been activated, then just a quick video to show you how you can check. Now, in case you didn't know, according to Microsoft, activation helps verify that your copy of Windows is genuine and hasn't been used on more devices than the Microsoft software license terms allow. And another good reason why you may want to check if your Windows OS has been activated is it means if activated, it will receive all the security and quality updates from Microsoft. And another good reason is um, it also means that all the features in the OS will be turned on, where if it isn't activated, that may not necessarily be the case. Now, on Windows 10 and Windows 11, it's a very similar process to check. And starting with Windows 11, just first of all, head to your settings. If you don't know where settings is, just do a search for settings. Uh, settings will always open on the system page by default in Windows 11 and just scroll down to where you see activation. There we go. Click on that, which opens up the activation page. And here you can see with the green tick active. And if we expand that activation state menu, it says Windows is activated with a digital license linked to your Microsoft account. So this OS has been activated. Now on Windows 10, it's a very similar process. But instead of heading to your settings system page, we have to head over to our update and security page. And I've just taken a screenshot to show you how from my Windows 10 device. So head to update and security in settings. Then on the left, you'll see activation and just expand that, open up activation. And yeah, you'll see Windows is, is activated with a digital license. So um, that means your Windows 10 has been activated. Now that's the simplest way to check on Windows 10 and Windows 11, but just to let you know about one or two extra ways you can check if you would be interested. Now another way you can check is to run command prompt. And if you don't know where command prompt is, just do another search accordingly for command prompt and just right click and run command prompt as administrator admin. And this is the command you want to enter. Now that's quite a mouthful. So I'll leave that command uh, in the description for you to copy and paste. So you just uh, paste that in and then you just hit enter. And there we go. It says the machine is permanently activated. Now, um, if your machine isn't activated and you run a uh, command prompt, um, this message will say Windows is in notification mode, which means it's not activated. So just take note of that. And then another way you can check and the final way and method for this video is on Windows 10 and Windows 11, you can just right click on your start menu, click on run and enter this same command, the same one you entered into command prompt and you just click on OK, and there you go. The machine is permanently activated, and as mentioned, if it isn't activated, it says Windows is in notification mode, which means it's not activated. So those are just a couple of ways that you can check to see if your Windows 10 and Windows 11 uh, OS is running as an activated version. So thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.